up, what's up? Back again. Hey, I just, uh, just thinking, man. You know I always got to record something when I'm thinking. You know? But, um, I was thinking, we got to really separate. You know how I feel about being called black. Well, this is one of the reasons I don't like being called black. I think we got to separate being black from um, nigger. Being black has to stop being associated with being called nigger. If you want me to um, cooperate as a black man. Because I do understand where you're coming from when you hold your allegiance to being black or call yourself black and associate us people of color with being black or called black. I can dig it. It's not like I'm, you know, a hater. But it's too closely associated with the word nigga. And these niggas out here are ruthless. You don't have to be black skin color to be a nigga. So, I don't even think you have to be a skin color to be black. You know? There's a lot of people consider themselves black that with white skin color. But, my whole point today is we got to separate the two because it's, it's, it's confusing the heck out of everybody, man. You got people on here talking about the black struggle, the history of the black struggle, and all of the honorable, honorable things, the great things. But in reality, it's being ruined by niggas. Um, that's why I don't associate myself with being called black. And it's a shame because... There is a struggle. But uh, when you associate yourself as a black person, you become a nigger in a lot of people's eyes, you know, national. So, you know, I, I, I came up with this idea when somebody did a video earlier about um, the African-American struggle and the black struggle and how <laughs> trying to take <laughs> slowly but surely. This is so They're not trying to take us out. They're not trying to take the niggas out. Um, I don't 